I never wanted to be a comedy director. I happened to make a short film at a film school that was a comedy and it just rocketed me into studio comedies. But I'm always trying to not just do comedy. I, I like really blending genres a lot. And so I wanted to do a movie where I'm intercutting two stories. One of them is this grounded buddy comedy and the other one is this very dramatic story of an immigrant. And so that balance was really important to me. I do an enormous amount of work even before pre-production, where I really visualize the movie shot for shot, edit for edit. It was kind of figuring out timing and pacing, how quickly I could shift tone on an audience. And so I knew going in, an audience member's not watching this being like, what is this? I always love movies that shift tone. It's kind of frowned upon in the movie industry, but those are the type of movies that really excite me. When I was a kid in Mexico, my father was like my best friend. Yo voy a volver en un dos por tres. And the day he left us, a part of me left with him. Bueno. Renato, your father's very ill. He really needs to see you. Listen, not to be rude, but I don't even see him as my father anymore. He never came back. I'm not going to the US five days before our wedding. This man's the source of all your issues. You have to go. Welcome to America. Renato. I just want to know what happened. And you will. Is this guy bothering you, Dad? Dad? Meet your brother, Asher. What? My sons, you deserve to know the truth about why I never came back. So I put a whole trip together for you both. My father's last wish is for me to go on a scavenger hunt with a brother I never knew I had. Yeah! Hey, there's another envelope in here. It's like a clue. He is weird. I'm sure he's not that bad. I'm gonna close my eyes. Do not wake me up until we get there. Start the car, dude! Start the car! Start the car! Oh, go! Go! Get out of here! Oh my god! Help! What the hell was that? <laughs> what is this place? Your father wanted to come home to you more than anything. But fate had something else in store for him. It's a claim ticket. I'm getting married in three days. I'm done with this. I'm going home. Don't you want to know how the story ends? He forgot about me. Why didn't he come back to us? This road trip's gonna give you that answer. We are so close. Uh-oh. We're out of gas. That was your only responsibility, dude. <laughs> I love watching you freak out, man. We can make ethanol to fuel your car. It's pure alcohol. Don't inhale it. Tie it up! Hey, that is strong, man. Yeah. You got us both completely wasted. <laughs> $500 I sink this shop. Hey, what happened? They're just overreacting. Just bought me $500.